Hey, this is Bean Gene Oakland with DJ Dell. Sneaker Rod X! What's good? It's your boy DJ Dells. In this hand, I got the Concord 11, the 2018 Retro. This was from Foot Action. And in this hand, I have a pair of Concord 11s I did not open up yet from Nike Store. I did a rant video about a week ago talking about these porch pirates that just go around stealing boxes off of people's porches. And I was saying how, you know, this is just crazy how they put this big swoosh on the box. It's like a dead giveaway that you got something valuable in this box for these thieves to eye out, you know, and go and steal the damn stuff. So I did a video and I asked you guys, do you guys want to see a comparison, a quality control video? Because I've done that in the past and the videos always have done very well, but I just wanted to check in with you. I always love the feedback. So many people said, yo, you got to do that video. So I definitely got you right now. We're going to do that video. Please bang that thumbs up on it right now. I want to see tons of likes on this video. Make me happy. Bang it right now. Go ahead. Bang that thumbs up button. And with that said, let's open up this box together and get to the quality control of these shoes. All right, so let's open up this box from Nike Store. And then we'll do this comparison. And Happy New Year, by the way. It is 2019. Excited about this year. Hope everyone has a great 2019. A better 2019 than 18. Even if you had a good 2018, you always want to have even a better one, right? Better year. So let's just dig into this box together. A little dent. I'm not like one of them crazy people with the boxes though. And um, I'm not dissing anyone that is, you know, I'm just saying I'm personally not. But the box is definitely pretty damaged. I mean, I prefer it to be mint, you know? It is what it is though. So let's see about the shoes, because that's really what's most important, right? The actual shoes. So looking at this pair right here, so far, everything looks good. Now you may see something that I don't see so please call it out if you see something wrong. I do see something a little sloppy, which we'll get to in a second. And that's on the back right there. That right there. The pad leather is sewed together. You see how it goes up high up there? Little things like that bother me. And there's a look at the medial side. A little sloppy right there. Look at the actual outsole. And this is just one shoe. We gotta look at the others. But I've reviewed the pair from uh, Foot Action. So I know that one is pretty much flawless, but I'm gonna show you guys it anyways. Outsole looks good. Looking at the toe, to the laces. So this shoe right here did see some flaws. Let's go to the other one. Don't really see anything so far. There's a look at the back. The back seems fine. Some may say it looks a little weird there. And there's a look at the other side. Is this a stain? Yeah, there's a stain right there. And this is literally out of the box, fresh out of the box. You see that? And looking at the toe. Let's look at the outsole real quick. So I showed you this new pair. Now let's get to this other pair. This is wrapping paper. If you didn't see the unboxing, I got this sent to me from Foot Locker, but it's actually from Foot Action and Jordan Brand. What happened is I found out the whole story behind it. Jordan Brand and Foot Action sent people 
two pairs of concords, one for them to keep and another pair to give as a gift. It says, you're receiving a pair to celebrate the impact you have on someone's life. And um, this person who works at Foot Locker got these two pairs from Foot Action and was nice enough to give me these. And I thought that was really, really something else because of the fact not only is it a pair of Concords as a gift, but this is someone that works in this industry. So that really meant a lot to me. It was really special that that person did that. So um, this pair I already reviewed. I did it on Foot Look. I've worn these before. And um, I just wanted to double check little things. Like I'm noticing over here how the pound leather is. It's just not straight how the cut is right there. But this is just minimal stuff that I'm pointing out. I mean, I'm hearing like horror stories, like the glue's messed up, it's all over the place, like things like that. Someone's saying like, you know, the stitching was totally like horrible on the shoe. You see here, we got two pairs and they're pretty decent, you know? I mean, there's nothing super, super wrong with them at all. See on the back, this is good. But yeah, that's one thing I've been hearing complaints, like with the stitching, like where the pan leather is connected, it's just not looking right. So that's why I'm kind of focusing on that. But this shoe is good. Let's check out this one real quick. And by the way, if you didn't see my top pickups of 2018, watch that video. It's a really awesome video. I worked super hard on it. And um, I would love for you to watch it because I show some awesome sneakers. And, you know, I worked hard on it. I want you guys to watch it. I think you'll enjoy it. And um, as we look at this shoe, it, it looks good. So we check out two pairs right here. Two pairs of Concords. Let me know your thoughts on the quality control. Me, I'm actually kind of impressed with, you know, I would say two for two with these. There are little tiny flaws, but it's nothing to go crazy about. But uh, you may disagree with me. You may see something that I totally missed. So leave all that in the comments, leave your thoughts. And I've done other videos like this comparing a lot of popular Jordans that I've doubled up on. So definitely watch these vids. Try to put like a pop up at the end of the video, definitely. Including my top 10 of 2018. Thanks for watching today's video. I hope you had fun watching. I had fun shooting it. Make sure to check out all of my sneaker addict t-shirts. They will be linked in the description box below. Check out the designs. I'm pretty sure there'll be at least one design you're definitely going to want. They come in short sleeve and long sleeve. Support the channel by picking one up. Also check out my Patreon, patreon.com backslash DJ Dells. I have an hour podcast I do every single week with Q&A and giveaways. We got about 42 episodes right now up. There'll be a lot more every week. You know, we just keep rocking. New episode, new episode. There's some free episodes to listen to as samples. And if you love what you're listening to, then definitely join, become a member today. Every single episode unlocks, plus DJ mixes and tons more to stream. So definitely check that out over at patreon.com backslash DJ Dells. All that will be linked in the description box below. And make sure to leave your comments and let me know how you felt about this comparison video. Thanks for tuning in. Much love. And we out. Good to talk to you, everybody. It's the one, it's the only, it's Eli Drake. I'm here with DJ Dells. Who? DJ Dells. Yeah. And uh, he's a sneaker addict, okay? I actually suggested rehab. The funny thing is, today, we got great taste, and I'll tell you why. Bang. Look at, oh, look at that. We rocking the same sneakers. Great minds think alike. Yeah. Is, what is your favorite Air Jordan? The 11s. The 11s? Hands down. In what colorway? Uh, Concords. OG, the first ones you ever saw. The white with the black. Why? They, they, they reminded me of wrestling boots the first time I saw them. I thought of like Bret Hart's boots. And I was like, man, those are awesome. Never saw a basketball shoe like that. I uh, became obsessed with them. Used to get all the East Bay magazines and just stare. And I was like, I need to have these. I need to have these. The first ones I ever got were the breads. Uh -huh. The bread 11s. Um, but uh, eventually, I think it was maybe three or four years ago, I finally got my first pair of Concords. You know he's official when he's mentioning East Bay magazines, East Bay magazine. catalogs. That is, you can't get more official. That's oh, yeah. very legit talk oh, right yeah. there. By the way, we noticed right here, we're noticing right here, you've got this uh, comes from? inspiration from the Jordan 11 exactly. t-shirt. Where can they buy this t-shirt? Uh, you can buy that at prowrestlingtees.com slash Eli Drake or 
right here at WrestleCade today, dummies, but you're not here. So, <laughs> ProWrestlingTees.com slash Eli Drake. Uh, now, do you know that they're re-releasing the Concords this year? I have heard that. And it's going to have the 45 in the back instead of the okay, 23. I dig that, because, yeah, because that was the way that they came out the first time, because uh, when he came back in 95. Yes. And he wore him against, uh, the, the, it was the Orlando Magic in the playoffs. Mm -hmm. uh, before he switched back to 23 in the middle of the series. Yeah. So, uh, yeah, so that would be cool actually have him. So that's releasing next week. So you may want to lock those in. Mental note. Now, I could swear, did you ever have any wrestling boots that had that Concord colorway? I did. You and, did? I'm, and I've also now I knew actually it. just started wrestling in Jordans, uh -huh. and I added a uh, like a sleeve that makes them look just like those boots that I have. Okay. So, it's pretty cool. I got good memory. I, I, I'm going to pat myself in the back. Barry Hollywood, uh, man. I mean... <laughs> oh, okay. Here we go. Oh, there you go. I'm going to throw this on top. Oh, wow. Oh, that is... Awesome right there. Let me get, let me get that close. Detail here, you know. That's my logo. That is awesome. You know, throw him on top. Make sure to check him out on Impact. 10 p.m.